Hey guys, what is going on? It is Goober here, and today we are going to be playing Warface. It's a military style first person shooter, and you can get this off of Steam for free. And I'm like, free first person shooter, I'm totally going to check this out. You even get to pick your character. And just as a side note, I am going to be having no face cam, so you can see the entire screen. And I am going to have muted gun audio because I did a voiceover first and I didn't really like the audio, so I'm just doing this now. And so there is no gun audio, but I'm gonna tell you, it's good. So if that's the decider, it's good and get it. Okay, so we're jumping into the first battle. As you can see, uh, those are the scopes for your starting gun, which I don't really think will be the decider. The movements are, and the controls are kind of the same, but I don't really like that it's a CPU. It's not multiplayer. They act really stupid and you can get pretty easy kills. So you decide if you like that or not. I mean, if this is your first, uh, first person shooter, I mean, totally get it. But if you're like an expert and you want a challenge, this is not the game for you and go see another game. But if you are a beginner, this is a pretty good game and you cannot kill your opponents. While it will make the gun noises and it'll absorb it, you can't kill them. And like two teammates of mine were just going at it, but obviously they can't kill each other. Also, it's not like one person is red and one person is blue. Only when you scope you can see that, which personally I don't really like because you could just shoot your opponent or a teammate and not even know. And that would be pretty darn bad. This is more like a campaign. Like, you just follow a track and follow your opponents. I'm not the biggest fan of that. I mean... Even though it is free and sure you'll play it now and then, but it's not my favorite type of game. You chase these CPU opponents like around the map, sometimes you get lost, and it's not, it's not my ideal game. But it can be pretty fun to just go at it, kill people, get that kill jacked up. I'm still learning stuff about the game itself, so I'm not sure if I'm playing it uh, totally correct. I'm not sure how to pick up guns, and so you just run out of ammo really fast, and they don't teach you how to melee in the tutorial or anything, so I think that's a flaw too. Now, this is military style, it says. I agree, like you're you're chasing people uh, with guns, it's good guys versus, versus bad guys. Uh, None of it is, like, based off of a battle in history or anything. It's just a normal map. Uh, you can sprint. That's all good. It's a little hard to crouch. You can only do it in, like, areas with low-hanging ceilings. Otherwise, you can't crouch. And I don't... I don't really like that. But, uh, again, this is a great game for beginners. If you're a beginner first-person shooter, I suggested this game all the way. But if you're anywhere above... You know, I can aim, I can kill the guy, reload, then, you know, I would just go ahead and buy a different game. So yeah, I'd say this is the best first person shooter for beginners because it's free, it'll teach you how to shoot, and if you like the game, I mean, yeah, get some more. Uh, it won't cost you anything to get this. I mean, if you don't like it, well, too bad. And if you are just looking for a new game, I also suggest this just to see if you like it. I mean, this is just my opinions, so uh, don't take my word for it. Sorry for this short episode. Uh, next video will actually be a collab with a smaller YouTuber, so stay tuned for that if you're looking for some new YouTubers to subscribe to. Again, sorry for the short episode, but this is just a quick game overview. Uh, I'll see you guys all in the next video. Be sure to check out some of Buddy's tech videos, uh, and my other gaming videos. I promise they're a lot better than this episode. Be sure to hit that big red subscribe button and gray it out if you have not already. And be sure to hit that bell icon. Two is better than one. That's why we're a dual channel. And I'll see you guys all in the next video.